this is so exciting! A mystery is unfolding right under our very noses! Don't you know all the answers, though? I know, it's kind of so scary. Why is it scary? It's not real. Same! Ah, isn't it awesome? Didn't you two be out mingling with everyone? Well, actually, the detective and the journalist can't be the murderer. Oh. Well, dang. So we're stuck here for an hour before going out and scooping the place. This way, there's always a neutral party. Yeah, that makes sense. Seems as though Amy's more excited about deciphering the mystery anyways. What do you think everyone's doing? Well, one of them is murdering. <laughs> I mean, that's, that's one thing you could say. Oh, probably expect their station is talking amongst one another. Everyone has roles to play, so they must be exploring their characters. Do you know what their character motives are, Amy? No, the lore cards are confidential. No one knows but the person who received them. Oh, okay. My backstory is that I was best friends with a flicky that decided to join the evil Dr. Eggman, kickstarting my desire for justice in the world. Why did the Flicky join? I said, um, another Mobian would have made sense, but a Flicky? My lore is that I'm a nosy person turned journal. Yeah, that seems about accurate. Not gonna lie, this sounds kind of fun. Does that mean you guys got your costumes along with the lore cards too? No, that wouldn't make sense. Cause why would they give Amy a birthday? Okay, cat. Wish I wasn't stuck on my Ah. The train started moving. Oh, yeah. It's too fast. Grab onto something. What's going on? Da, I'm slipping. Hold on. I can't. Oh, that sounded painful! What? Where are we? You're both awake! Yeah... Seems like the train has slowed down considerably. Is everyone okay? Yeah, my head's spinning a bit, but I'm okay. Seems we've been knocked into the dining car's closet. This train can reach such incredible speeds! We're getting our money's worth in this experience, that's for sure. Yep. Nothing says like top quality like a concussion. Is this actually intended? It's my first day, so I'm not really sure. I don't recall them warning me about this from the interview, you know. We should go check on the other's desk. Could you get the door? Of course. Huh, it seems the door is blocked and I don't think it's budging. Amy, give that fallen shelf a whack with your... That's what it's called? You don't have it. Let's find another way out. I'll uh, start looking for clues. I'll search over here. You can't start searching for clues. You haven't even seen the body yet. I know Amy, she's hiding something. I suppose she did wake up before us. Something could have happened. Listen, I know I'm the detective here, but all the best detectives are sidekick have sidekicks. I'm gonna need your help. Let's gather clues on why Amy's acting this way and interrogate her about it. She didn't bring her mallet. Check out everything you can around the closet and we'll show it to Amy to uncover the full situation. Gather evidence and interrogate, got it. She either doesn't have Yep. You can count on me, Tails. I won't turn evil like your ex flicky companion did. <laughs> okay, so either your mallet is not. Oh god, I know the microwave now. Well, that secret's out. 
How is this evidence? Something's always hidden in the trash. It's empty. But on the bright side, this is a very clean trash bin. I might become as optimistic as this kid. Yeah. Fire extinguisher. That's actually good to know. What do you think, Tails? Want me to cook any of this for you? When we get out of here, sure. I normally never make microwave meals. I prefer to cook. My cast iron skillet has gotten a lot of use lately. I can cook a mean cast iron pizza. I've only had microwave lunches this week. Ah, the wet floor sign. Keeping people alert and safe. Once I slipped on some spilled juice at the grocery store. No wet floor sign at all. Luckily Sonic was there to catch me. Aww. But he was going so fast he also slipped on the juice. <laughs> he slid into an older gentleman's shopping cart. It's just not that counts, I suppose. What happened right here? The shelf blocking our exit is currently not budging. Hey Des, look closely at this! Yeah, that's what I was thinking. There is nothing the shelf could have fallen into and keep damage wasn't there before. The train has too much upkeep. I feel like this is important. We should log it. Crack on the shelf, add it to your inventory. Wait, what? Cool, we got a crack on a shelf in our inventory. Um... Oh, there's the hammer. What's this, a rod? The tip is broken. It looks like they've originally been attached to something. Yeah, I figured that it was either broken or she didn't bring it. I think we found enough clues. Let's go and take it, Amy, and find out what really happened. What's the latest? Find any clues yet? I found a spoon. If we find two more, we can dig ourselves dig ourselves out on a train. I'll keep looking. All right, let's start interrogation. Amy, we believe you're hiding something from us. What? You accuse me on my own birthday? How dare you! This isn't going to be easy, is it? I've been stuck here just like you two. What in the world do you think I'm hiding? Amy was awake before Tails and I were. What could she have done in that time? I mean, she could have attempted to escape. I don't think you're, you were sitting idly while Dusk and I were knocked out. You attempted to escape the closet. Prove it. Show me the evidence that I attempted to escape, or help me search a way out. Dusk, let me st step you through this. First, find the correct piece of evidence from your inventory. Once I've been de de detected, we must form our argument to fight back. Well, there's two things. What? Some damage on the shelf is supposed to prove something? It fell over. Damage makes sense. We have no argument there. You're grasping. Okay, Tails, what now? Well, now we follow the tra this train of thought. How does the crack on the shelf relate to Amy? Hmm. Well, I get stumped. I like to think... What would Sonic do? Um, he would run? Sonic's a force to be reckoned with. He's always running forward, collecting rings, crushing badnecks. He never loses. Like an endless runner game. I play a lot of those on my phone. Uh, sure, whatever works. Just close your eyes and think. What would Sonic do? Find your argument. I don't think Sonic's much of a thinker. I'm sorry, what? Why am I- what? Why am I doing this now? What the hell is going on? Why am I suddenly playing a bad Sonic game? That doesn't even sound like spring! What's that? 
Oh, is that the idea? Is that my thought? Sure, this shelf fell, but there's nothing around here for the shelf to fall onto. You're telling me on a train this will count that the damage was there before we arrived? Ooh, well, I... I believe someone is responsible for hitting the shelf. You just said nothing was around for the shelf to fall onto. What was the shelf hit with then? What is that, a stick? You truly believe a stick would do this kind of damage? Are you kidding me? I have to do this every time? <laughs> You're right, a stick can't do this kind of damage on the shelf on its own. But if it's attached to something, it could, like, let's say, a hammer? Heck! <laughs> this isn't a stick at all, is it? This is actually a handle for your Pickle Pickle Hammer. You attempted to hit the shelf out of the way, but you failed. The handle to your hammer will snap right off. Ah. Uh, It's as you both said, I tried to get us all out with my hammer, but I failed. I gave the shelf one big whack and the handle ripped right off. I figured it was no big deal and I tried to hide it, but I suppose my embarrassment got the better of me. She does look generally sorry about the situation. I never expected your hammer to snap like that, Amy. It was one of my backups. Let her carry around. Well, lucky for you, I'm a detective, and I dabble as a mechanic. Let me see both pieces of the hammer. Just tighten things here, a little elbows grease here, and fixed. Tails, thank you! According to my calculations, if you hit the shelf right here, it should do the- my goodness. He's freaking Sherlock Holmes. I don't think he had to destroy it. I don't think that was necessary. Whatever. Wait, is that? It can't be! Sonic? Someone murdered my du- What? <laughs> She's smiling! <laughs> Looks like the game's begun. I'm finding out who did this at once. Amy, wait! I want to figure out who did this too! Wait for me! What a whirlwind. I'm exhausted already. That was really convincing, Sonic. Sonic? Eh. Body's numb. Can't move. What are you saying? I don't understand. I just need to rest. Sonic? Sonic? Oh dear. I feel myself panicking. Come on, Des, what do I do? So, he's actually dead? Maybe you should make sure that Sonic has some, I don't know, medical attention or something? Oh my god, what happened to the arcade machine? Whoa, look at this place! Uh, I'm supposed to be looking for tape. Das, come over here! I think Amy's already gone on ahead. Seems she's really excited. Did you need something from me? Uh, yeah, just a question, really. How do I put this? What if Sonic is actually hurt? He's laughing? Sonic doesn't go down so easily. He's on a train full of his friends. Nothing would actually happen to him. Well, except for an accident. We're just all really committed to the mystery for Amy. You have nothing to worry about. Promise. 
Well, his Sonic's legs snap a lot in strange spots. He's fu- Does he nap without a pulse? It's making a lot of sense, but I can't shake what Sonic said to me. Any more evidence to figure out what's going on? Well, can I tag along with you? If you don't mind, is it cool I tag along with you? Oh, of course, sure! Now, if I ever need a snack, you've got me. Yeah, fair. As I said, the best detectives have sidekicks, so I'm happy to have you. Wait, then why do you have a sidekick? If you ever catch me looking gloom, though, just know it's because, uh... Where's my Lord card? The last guy to work a case with me ditched a practice to join the evil duck. The Flecky? Not a proper detective without baggage, yeah, I suppose. This is true. Oh my goodness, you're doing an accent. Why? You vermin! What are y'all doing in my saloon? He's trying so hard to stay in character. That goes, we're trying to figure out who murdered Sonic. I can see that. Amy moseyed through and told me all about it. <coughs> Enough of that. I wonder how long he kept that voice up for Amy. We were wondering if you could tell us what you were up to before the murder. Anything to help us establish your alibi and... Nope, I have nothing to tell to either of you. Leave me alone. He's obviously agitated about something. But why take it out on us? I know better than to argue with Knuckles, so it seems we're on our own. Dust, we need to figure out what Knuckles was up to while we were all apart. Let's get to get clues and interrogate. Um, I think this might have something to do with it. <laughs> oh my god, is that Chaos Cola? Let's talk to the hand. Robotic guns are very helpful. Let's see what I'm doing to my hair. You fixed it up a bit, that's incredible! What interesting tech. Uh-oh, should I fear my job a little bit? How... How well can I microwave? <laughs> Breathtaking views! The train passes by some incredible sights! Just happy to be traveling at a normal speed. You get nauseous pretty easily. You have to avoid things like roller coasters. I don't mind roller coasters, but I find myself running on the tracks more than I do riding the carts. Never understand this friend group, yeah, me neither. Yes, this is interesting. Sure, but why are there three? Uh, Knuckles was really thirsty? Lipstick. Oh my god, was Rouge here? That's not Knuckles' color at all, someone must have been here. Oh my god, Knuckles! Are you a ladies' man? Let's check here. Sadly, this is empty as well. I'm starting to think your theory on someone always being hidden in trash is flawed. It's only a matter of time, Tails. Have faith. It's as they say, one man's trash is another man's treasure. Well, I would say that it's... It would be a natural attempt to, uh... Dispose evidence. I think Tails is ignoring me. Decent cash reward for finding this robot. Maybe I'll keep an eye out. Poor Alma Chow. I hate to see him like this. What do they do? Medical malpractice? <laughs> okay. Clearly, we won't be able to give this game Super Monkey Ball try. No, I played that. It's okay. I think it broke with a train spit up. The damage looks more... Because from punches? Who could have done- who do you think? What are you two looking at me for? Smash arcade in the inventory? I think we found enough clues. Let's go and take it Knuckles to find out what really happened. I wanna find out about that lipstick. But I told you to leave me alone. I like your hat. Huh. 
Knuckles, are you blushing? I said leave me alone. It doesn't look like he's just being complimented. Did you just adjust your hat a bit so we can see it better? I said leave! Knuckles, that's gonna need to determine what you were doing during the hour the murder took place. They told you to buzz off, but you're not getting anything out of me. Thankfully, we don't need you to say much. What happened here is pretty obvious. We have evidence too. Now, let's take a look at your inventory. What was distracting Knuckles during the time Sonic was murdered? Well, this is the first thing I want to talk about. Ugh, quick water break. Heh. <laughs> Wrong choice, Dust. Let's try again. Oh, come on! I want to know about the used cops! Please! Fine. The arcade machine? Heh. <laughs> What makes you think I touched it? Well, let's take a look here. Giant frickin' fist and a broken machine. Ah, that's a tough one. Oh, there's spike balls now. Cool. And there's cliffs. They're being more generous with the rings. This isn't a tough one, Knuckle. Why did it take 30 rings to figure it out then? Knuckles, you clearly touched the arcade machine because... The arcade is covered in punches. What evidence do you have that the damages are punches? Why are you all staring at my hands for... <laughs> why do you think? Knuckles, you clearly destroyed the arcade machine, but why? I need a punching bag, and none of none were available to me? Just a sudden urge to punch, huh? I believe repairing the arcade machine will give us our answer. How will you... I'm on it, Dust. Distract Knuckles' life. Distract? Wait, this is how I have to distract him? Whatever, we're still good. All I did was stand there and think. No, don't look at the score. Oh no! Quick, look at this. I like this version of me. I'm putting it up now. Okay, what does this tell us? Um. It tells me... Wait, Vector was here? Well, that explains the third glass. Oh, and he beat him by one point. Nothing, obviously. It tells us something massive. Look at the name on the top of the list. It's Vector. He's supposed to be in the library car. Yeah. Vector is beginning to be painted here. You competed with Vector to see who could get the highest score. And Vector beat you by one point. And in frustration, you destroyed the arcade cabinet. Gah. He's punching the air in frustration. You're guessing. Where's your proof? Where's your evidence? Vector's a common name. Prove to me it was, it was here now. Is it a common name? Now, Dusk, what proves Vector was here with Knuckles? I guess this? No! That was strange that there was more than one cup sitting next to you. Well, you were supposed to be participating in the murder mystery game for Amy's birthday. You and Vector enjoyed some drinks playing arcade. It's, I'm, it's not like... It's not like I wasn't... 
Uh, don't, don't tell Amy. I think we're on the right track here. But what about the lipstick? It's as you say, Victor popped in at me. Top of the hour, I wanted to play the arcade machine with me. We went back and forth trying to figure the game out, but when we did, we completed with a higher score. When he bested me, I destroyed the machine. No proof of his win. I was trying to fix the arcade cabinet before you two came in. Honest. I didn't want to be caught. And that's my story and alibi. I already told you an abridged version of this to Amy. Boy, his, this friend group has a lot of pride issues. I explained why I to use cups. But what are the cup with the lipstick mark? Rose was here too. It's inconsequential, not worth mentioning. She searched around for something but failed, made fun of our game and left. Obnoxious that one. Well, you offered her a drink apparently? Listen, I don't know why she showed up. I've told you everything that happened before the train sped up. You're not satisfied? Will you two relent? I'm understanding the scenario. Vector visit my games, we could find something. Knuckles destroy the machine. Well, that makes sense to me. Thank you for answering so many of our quit. Actually, that's not everything, is it, Knuckles? I want to step back to something I noticed. One more name on that high score list doesn't make sense. Okay. Um, toast, apple, bread, Altima? Altim? Altim? This one? Yeah, that's true. Who here goes by- Oh my god, it's Shadow. Shadow was here. You may not know this, Bust, but there's someone here who goes by the title, the ultimate- Yeah. So... There's Shadow. Nothing sneaks by you, does it, bud? Vector and I were struggling so much the game, but then Shadow dropped by. So Shadow was here too. So wait a minute. Knuckles, Vector, Rouge, and Shadow. He tossed the game and was the first to get his name on the scoreboard. Vector and I then fought to beat Shadow's score. They're both very annoying. You all immediately had to compete, huh? Shadow told me to lock the door and to not open it for anyone. Then Vector was leaving. I locked the door behind him, saw no one else after blocking the door. That's the honest truth. So when Amy came through here not too long ago, did you open the door for- No, she has the key. She has her own key. No, I think she has some sort of key too. Yeah, that kind of gave us- but yeah, exactly. Well, I have a lot of questions. What happened to the library to cause Vector to come here? Why is Shadow locking doors, and what was Rue searching for? I don't know, they didn't tell me, even though I asked with that cowboy accent. <laughs> You're gonna have to find that and ask them yourselves. More information I expected to get here, but it seems we can move on. And as of right now, I believe your story, Knuckles. Well, only know for sure when we confirm things with Vector. Fair enough. Library's the next car. I'll open the lock for you. Give whoever chaos Sonic an earful for me, Detective Tails and Butler. I liked it better when I wasn't when he wasn't talking to us. Well do, Sheriff. Come on, Desk, let's head to the library. This is way more exciting than a microwave chili dog. Dusk! Coming! Wow, what a crazy ride.